Good evening and thanks for joining us. Police are investigating tonight after three men were found dead and another seriously injured in a Roseville apartment. Family members are trying to piece together what happened. I don't know much about, you know, what's going on yet. Inside a Roseville apartment near Fry and Elridge. We have three individuals who are deceased and another individual down at the hospital fighting for his life. Joe Adams, deputy chief with the Roseville Police Department, says someone got a call from one of the men inside. That individual promptly called the police department. They found three men dead with knife and gunshot wounds and said one man was suffering from a cut on his neck. Police say that the four knew each other. The one who survived is still recovering in the hospital and is expected to live. At this time, we haven't been able to communicate with him to get any more information as to the events from last night. I'm one of the brothers uh, of the deceased. Cha Vang and other family members arrived this morning. When we talked to him, he said he believed his brother died, but was still waiting on identification. He says he was 32. Still very young. Police said the Minnesota Bureau of Criminal Apprehension is still investigating and couldn't tell us more about the circumstances of what happened or who was responsible. They did say that they believed everyone involved was inside that apartment when police arrived. I, I cannot spare a word now. It's, it just it just cannot believe it. I, I cannot believe it. It's, I, it's very unexpected. I just heard the news this morning and just throw me off. It just threw me off. Sammy Solina, CARE 11 News.